Hey guys, just a quick video on my vapor honing cabinet built from a Harbor Freight blast cabinet. I purchased some plans from HTMR, How To Motorcycle Repair. He has a YouTube channel and a website. He offers plans for three different versions of cabinets, two made from Harbor Freight and one larger cabinet made from plywood. It's worth the cost. He has how-to videos with the cost of those plans. He has spreadsheets with all the parts you need and links to where you can get them. So he makes it really simple. Now I've modified his bare bones version. I moved all my bulkheads, my fresh water, my slurry, my air. He had all that in front here and I moved it to the back just for a cleaner look. And I also moved my air regulator to the back as well. So I just wanted to show some of the modifications I've made and hopefully it'll give you some ideas if you're trying to figure out how to build your own vapor honing cabinet. I was able to wire in my two LED light bars into the factory Harbor Freight switch. I used a simple ball valve for my wiper fresh water. I also installed the upgraded wiper motor and it is switched right here as well. I wanted to be able to see the pressure as I was blasting and not have to kind of look down in front of the cabinet. So I cut out a bracket on my CNC plasma cutter, got that bolted in and attached the regulator. I think that'll be a nice upgrade. I just used some scrap metal I had laying around for my cart, cut out some sheet metal in the back to kind of try to hold the cart in place. Pretty simple and just use scrap material. Now in wanting to keep things looking a little bit cleaner, I installed my fresh water in the back of the cabinet. Hose will screw in right here. It supplies water for a rinse hose that's inside as well as my wiper rinse. You can kind of see how I connected my regulator. I just drilled a couple holes in the cabinet and bolted that in. I used all Flexzilla hoses. My air will plug into the foot pedal and then come into the regulator and then into the cabinet. And here's my slurry into the cabinet. Here's my freshwater rinse setup so I can rinse parts inside or out in a bucket if I need to. Here's my dual light bars wired into the factory Harbor Freight switch, the HGMR gloves, and the upgraded HGMR 5 horsepower gun. Lastly, my air and slurry bulkheads in the left rear corner of the cabinet. Well, hopefully you'll get a few ideas from my modified version of the bare bones cabinet.